What's up, my people? It's your boy, Juizy. All right, guys. I want to stay out until 2.50. And be... Not, not be unpicky. Like, I don't want to do DoorDash earn by time type not picky. I want to be... Still stay a little bit picky. That might take a long time to make 250, but I would like to try to make it because look, even if I had to go past three in the morning, I would like to try because I want to start doing like six to six, 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. or maybe 8 p.m. to 8 a.m. and then 8.30 I go to the gym and after that I go to sleep. So I have my schedule 8 p.m. to 8 a.m. Because if you look at the, the Uber map, it's busy after 8 p.m. Like it, the bar goes higher. I wish, you know, I'm gonna try to put it on the screen. Uh, the bar goes higher after 8 p.m. and then it goes back down at 8 a.m., 8 or 9 a.m. So it's like between 8 or 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. is like not busy according to the Uber map. And I'm sure it's probably the same way with, you know, the other apps because it's usually the same. Well, maybe not groceries. Groceries it has to be during the day. But with Uber and I'm pretty sure DoorDash, like I already told you guys on, on my last video that I got a lot of high, high, not high paying, but $1 per mile, eight, let's say $8 for six miles type DoorDash orders that, you know, during the day, it, it, it may take some time because of the traffic. But at min, like after midnight where there's no traffic, you could do those orders quick. Bah, you could do them quick, quick, quick. And you get some Walgreens orders and, you know, stuff like that. So I would like to try, but I, I would have to force myself to stay awake. So we'll, I'm gonna try, guys. Let's try to stay until 2.50. We'll see what happens. Instacart, I'm gonna stay, I'm gonna try to do more Instacart orders. I need five more, five more orders to be able to get to Diamond for the next the next quarter. So five orders should be easy peasy. I'm gonna, ha I'm gonna hang out by like a Total Wine where there's restaurants and stuff like that. So maybe I'll do some Total Wine orders, some restaurants. It's under a garage. So I'm not burning in the sun, even though it's still hot in the shade because it's humid. The humid, the the humid heat, uh, the humid hotness heat here in Miami, Florida, is different than like the Texas heat. Texas heat, if you're under the shade, you feel good. But in Miami, even if you're in the shade, you're still burning, sweating. So we'll see what happens, guys. 250, please, Joe Easy, make the 250. I want to see. Look, last week I made it till like three in the morning, but supposedly after three, like four to eight a.m. is booming too but i didn't stay that long guys i was like bro i was i don't know i just went home but i'm gonna try man i'm gonna, I'm gonna try and i'll try to record as many orders as possible with you guys but yeah i don't want to run up the miles to be able to make money so i'm gonna be still be picky so it may be there may be some some a lot of downtime but it's fine i'll be patient i have my ipad i'm gonna watch I have to watch a new show. I already watched all the shows I'm watching. Let me know in the comments what show should I start watching next. I like the Vikings type shows nowadays. So recommend me something like that or maybe like a Suits. Remember Suits? Something like that. Or a show that I could binge while I'm waiting for orders. So let me know. Or I could work on my Giga app. I have to set up my laptop so that I could test the app on my phone. I'm talking about the Giga app. Go download it now. The On my phone and is I have to set it up for that. But we'll see what happens. The parameters. Uber eats $6, $6 minimum. And then the ride share, I'll do the $5 minimum. But $1 per mile, $20 per hour, and that's it. For Instacart, I would like to, you know what, let's do that. For Instacart, I don't want to take anything under 10 bucks. So $10 and higher, even if it's like one item. It's going to be hard, but I'm not hard, but I'm going to be missing out on maybe some $8 orders for like one item. But I want to see if I can be picky with that. $10 minimum. We'll see what happens. We'll see how I feel. How about that? All right. Now, with that being said, don't forget to smash that like button. Blow up on the YouTube one. And if you like this video at the end, you want to watch future videos of me doing delivery to a couple of my people. Let's get the hustle started. Let's go. All right, my people. The time is 11.30 in the morning. And we accepted a $25 order. Uber Eats for 12 miles. but the only And it's two customers. The only problem is that it's going to downtown. But it's, I think it's like the out the outer part of downtown so it's not that bad but it's still downtown guys and i you know those things with the parking and always trying to illegally park but hopefully both those buildings have valets where they just let you in for the most part they you know there's valets that let you in but there's some buildings that it's just it's not it's not good guys 
I think the worst part of downtown is picking up orders. When you're picking up orders from restaurants, they never have parking. But if you're going to a building, sometimes you, you know, most of the time you're you're good. Like you're just parking the valet for a little bit. But this is a uh, this is the first order for it. Oh no no wait wait hold on hold on we accepted a lift ride though. It was 5.25 miles. I thought it was it was supposed to be a dollar per mile. Estimated 4.6 miles and the final was 5.25 miles. So are you telling me that? Wow, lift lied to me then. Lift lied to me. It was supposed to be 4.6 miles. I ended up driving 5.25. And I didn't take any shortcuts or I, I took it the exact route that it was supposed to be. So they straight up lied to me. Lift. Wow. And they didn't even pay me more. That's uh, that's kind of messed up. But whatever, let's get this Uber order. Hello. How you doing? Is the pick up an Uber? Thank you. Yeah, appreciate it. Have a good one. Bye. All right, we got the first order. Let's go to the second place. Let's do it. So we made it to our second destination. The name of the place is called Roasters and Toasters. Look, these guys are on the wrong side of the road. <laughs> Okay. Picking up? Yeah. What's the name? Uh, the name is uh thank you. Good one. one. Alright, we got the second order. These people are usually look, look, they're on the wrong side of the street. Look. Now I have to get out from there. No, I could go around. I'm not gonna wait there. Okay, so the first drop off was easy. It's 1223. It was easy. It was a Catholic church and then there was like two cops, man, all suited up. I'm like, bro, what, what's what's up with the security? It's crazy. I mean I and then I, I got out and then he he's he he, he gets to he gets to he, he walks towards me and he's like I was like oh this is an Uber. He's like, oh who's it for? I was like, oh it's for this person. They're like, okay, I'll take it. I was like, alright, cool. Alright, this one is gonna be for sure an apartment bu building. But I think there's a valet that don't let me in this easy. Alright guys, the time is 12.48 p.m. and we accepted a Taco Bell order. I'm not optimistic that it's gonna be ready anytime soon. But I accepted it because it was $6, 1.3 miles. The drive through is packed. This is Uber Eats. Wish me luck though. Let's go. Gracias. Sí, claro. Gracias. Buen día. All right, we got the order, my people. Let's deliver. I'm surprised they asked to confirm. They never ask. At least this Taco Bell. I mean, I've only been in a few times to this Taco Bell. But all right, let's deliver. Let's do it. Oh, we're going. Oh snap, that car left. Oh man, I could have parked there, man. I hate picking up from places like this. Well, the time is 1.07 p.m. and we accepted a $17 order for 13 miles. These two customers and it satisfied my parameter. So I'm just gonna accept everything that satisfied my parameter no matter where it's going. Just to see if I could, if I could just, you know, keep it moving. So it doesn't, doesn't matter where it goes. I'm just gonna accept it. And this is a Planta Burger. Oh, I think Sweet Green is the other place. So they're both here, perfect. So the first place is called Planta Burger. Where's it at? So Sweet Green is the second place, I think. Let, let me make sure. Yeah, Sweet Green. So this has to be the second destination. So it's perfect. I don't have to drive anywhere else. But let's go to the first place. Planta Queen, is that what it is? Planta Queen? No, Planta Burger is on top. Is there some stairs? All right, there's stairs at least. Oh, there's an elevator right there too. It keeps saying Planta Queen, but it's Planta Burger, bro. Pick up at Planta Queen. Okay, we'll not say to pick up at Planta Queen. How you doing? It's to pick up at Uber Eats. For All right, we got the order, guys. Not much wait. Wait time, maybe eh, 30 seconds, a minute, not much. So let's go to our second destination, which is right across. Let's do it, baby, let's go. Sweet Green, I already told you the name. Uh, for what's the name? Yeah, it's not sweet green. Oh, sorry. I went to the wrong place. It's because that place was green, so I thought it was sweet green. Thank you. Hello. All right, guys, we got both orders. Let's go deliver. Let's do it. All right, guys, the rain is back again. I know this is Miami, so it rains all the time, but the last few weeks it's been raining like randomly, very on and off, and it's, up, it's getting on my nerves, guys. 
it is getting on my last nerve. It's, it's really, it, it messes up your, your, like if you know if it's gonna rain the whole day, you'll know if you should work or be prepared maybe for like, you know, have like boots, my boots ready and have everything ready. But it's like, you can't be ready because you don't know if it's gonna rain the whole day or for five seconds. And it's just uh, very inconsistent, this rain, man. And it's just super, super annoying. See, look, now the rain is over after I delivered the order. And then I just accepted another order, guys, by the way. I, it was a $5 Uber Eats for four miles. I accepted it because it satisfied the $1 per mile and the 20. it said $22 per hour. And I accepted it, and then I forgot, oh, snap, I told myself I wasn't going to accept uh, less than $6 Uber Eats. But I did it anyway, guys. This is the package. Uh, it's a package, so maybe... Yeah, that's fine guys i just want to keep accepting orders as long as like i'm being strict with it though like there was some rides that was 19 dollars and 97 cents per hour and i said no no let me be super strict look this last order it took me 57 minutes 17 dollars so and it was supposed to be a 21 dollar an hour order but because of all this traffic is taking me forever so I'm, I'm hoping now uber starts telling me the truth and it accounts all this traffic because the traffic probably wasn't there when I accepted the order and it just happened because of the rain. That's probably what happened, man. So 17 freaking dollars for all that work that I did. Well, I mean, not that all that work, all that driving that I did. It was supposed to be $21 an hour, that $17 order. So I'm hoping that the Uber tells me the truth now since there's already traffic, you know? So we'll see. So that's the place that I have to go to, guys. It's like a flower place. It's a flower place, $5, four miles. And it's actually taking me to north, um, like close to North Miami Beach. And I might just chill there for some Instacart. I mean, that place, there's, it's good money. So I'll just go there so I don't have to drive back dead miles, you know? All right, so I didn't notice, so I just got a message. I, first time I ever get a message from, uh, from, the vet, from the merchant. This is a package delivery. I forgot to tell you guys. It's a package delivery and it is right there, the food truck. I'm just trying to avoid the uh, the water. So it, it is not the plant place, guys. It's that food truck there. And I'm confirmed, too. Okay. All right, appreciate it. Have a good one. All right, so this is it. I think it's like some fish. Yeah, look. It's like fish right here. You guys see it? So that is what it is, guys. Let's go deliver. Guys, I got to deliver uh, this order to one of these, these fancy houses. Look, one of these. I don't know if it's the one with the yacht, but it's one of them. Pretty cool, right? You guys see all this traffic here? It's, I don't know what's going on in the front, but I don't think Uber calculated all this. And it made me do a, a, a circle, like a square, but the delivery address is right here. It's right there uh, to the to the left. So I don't know why Uber, well, I know why, I think I know why Uber told me to, to go all the way around instead of making it right there, because there was a cop there and I, I think that road was blocked, but it's not blocked anymore. Is this it? No, it's supposed to be the first one here. The first building here. According, yeah, this is it. All right, my people, the time is 2.30 and we completed that order. And look, this is what I'm thinking. Because look at all this traffic. I'm thinking about just walking to the place because unless the, the traffic's already moving, it's 0 0.2 miles away. How much, what is that? That's uh, 0.25 is 400 meters. That's a lap around a track field. So, point two, I don't think it's that bad, guys. Because, look, I just have to make a right in this light right here. So, I'm just going to... Oh, look, I have to... You know what? This one, I'm going to take it because it's the same restaurant. So, and and you already know with all this. Look at all this. Look, I parked right there. And I've got all that traffic. So, the other one, it was $19.80 per hour. So, it's not the $20. But it's an extra 5 I'm really getting paid 10 bucks for so instead of five i get paid ten dollars it's a win-win i want to see what the traffic is here or oh, are they i think it's probably they're blocking why is there so much traffic here i think they're they're stopping i don't i don't know why there's traffic but whatever the second order is going to take us out of here so it's good even though maybe i would i would have liked to stay here because of the the Publix, but it's fine guys look that's what's going on there they're, they're stopping all these, uh, all these, they're blocking traffic because of, I guess, because of school. 
I think this is the place right here, guys. And it's, it's like kind of raining a little bit, so I'm like hoping that please, please don't don't start raining on me, man. Please. Man, there's mad cops in this neighborhood. It's like a it's like a, a rich neighborhood. Hey, how you doing? I gotta pick up two Ubers. The first. Yeah, buen día. Igualmente, bye. Por casualidad tenía como una bolsa para poner arriba, ¿no? Ah, we we uh we got the order, but it's kind of raining a little bit. I'm just gonna have to run, guys. Run to the car. So let's go. Man, this thing smells good. You have the pin, the four-digit pin. No, we got a bridge going up. Man, there's so many obstacles today. The rain, the school traffic, everything. They don't want us to make money. They want to slow us down, man. That's why I want to do graveyard shift, man. I'm done with this shift. It's hot, it's always raining. Yeah, it's gonna probably rain at night, but it doesn't probably, it's not gonna rain as much as during the day because of the heat. And then, you know, you, you guys already know about all that uh science but yeah guys um yeah uh, see, see, yeah, yeah. all right guys so we are currently right here north miami beach and i'm literally I, I dropped off my i'm gonna tell you guys the orders that i did i dropped off my last passenger uh, right here so i parked here because there's a publix and this publix is good man this publix has it has good orders it's just that i don't drive all the way over here anymore because a lot of times it's probably not worth it. Look, I got a dollar tip. Thank you. That's probably the last passenger. Appreciate you. Is this one good? Oh, it's getting me out of here. No, no. Where's the other one? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, we're doing this one. It's $19, but it's getting me out of here, I guess. Let's see if I get it. All right. Let's go, baby. Let's get out of here. Another thing is that every time Uber sends me to get past the, that toll, then I would accept it because it's well if I'm out going in, I'll, it doesn't matter. But getting out of this place, that tolls a dollar seventy-five. So you know, I I'd rather get an order getting out of here. You know what I'm saying? So they could pay me the dollar seventy-five tolls, which is good. So guys, it has been amazing. Oh, let me actually show you why I'm, I picked this. I dropped somebody off right, you know, right around the area, and I I found this Win Dixie here. Look, O M G, guys, O M G. I couldn't. I keep. I keep doing getting rides, and I'm not. I'm not declining. I am far away right now. I am by Dol by Dolphin Stadium. Look at this. I'm gonna zoom out, and normally I'm like all around here, and I'm all the way up here, guys. But I'm look. I'm gonna show you guys the orders that we did. So I have this Win Dixie here that I'm gonna see if I could get some Uber Eats orders because Uber Eats works with Win Dixie. Some shopping. Some good shopping orders. Oh, let me see if there's an Uber here. No, that one's not good. So we've only done rides. It's not even orders because I take you guys along the orders, but the rides, I don't, I'll tell you, I usually tell you after. So I got two rides, guys. No, no, more than two. First, it was a $6.16 ride. 1.29 miles, 10 minutes to complete. And then this one was the lift one that I just finished doing right now. $7.02, 6.36 miles, 22 minutes to complete. Yeah, it was supposed to take 20 minutes. It was like $21 an hour. That's why I accepted it. It was within my parameters. But I've been accepting orders. I'm so far away right now. But normally, I'll decline orders going way too north. But I'm, not, but I'm like, bro, you know what, man? I'm just going to accept whatever. Even if it takes me up north, I just want to make money. And it's been paying off. I, I'm at over 100 bucks already. And it's 5 o'clock. So can I make 250 with this strategy? The only thing is that, look, I got 18 bucks so far on Lyft. And I can't do lift on a rental so it's only 18 but i i'm currently at 93 smackaroos i don't know if i have, if i have any tips on oncoming on on uh, bleh, upcoming what am i saying i don't know but most of the work is on uber anyway so if i do get a rental again i just have to know that i will not have any lift rides oh wow and uber, uh, uber x gave me a tip thank you uber x passenger i appreciate you I was three bucks, but I'm gonna tell you right now the orders that we did. First, let me thank let me thank everybody for the tip. Okay, so here are the orders that we did. The rides. So we did a five dollar and thirty seven cent ride, one point six miles, five minutes to complete. 
a nine dollar and six cent ride that was the cus the cu the passenger tipped me three bucks thank you passenger who is it who was that let me see i like to put a face to the tip on uber x oh my god i know who this was is that it was like a group of girls i don't know if they're i mean i don't know if they're 18 or yet or what but it was just a group of i picked them up at a hotel i took them to a restaurant three dollar tip thank you passengers i love you guys oh my goodness all right so and then after that we did a 14 dollar and 59 cent that i showed you on the last clip ride 29 minutes to complete 7.3 miles so 29 minutes to complete 14 cent ride so that's 30 dollars an hour all right guys we've been doing very very good guys very very good i'm just gonna keep accepting i'm here at winn dixie uh, let's have some lunch uh, the, another reason why i stopped is because i want to have lunch too so let's have some lunch all right my lovely you be let us have lunch what do we have here we have yellow rice we got mashed potato I'm not gonna take that because it's eighteen dollars an hour. I gotta do twenty dollars an hour. So this platano maduro, I know I'm Dominican and my my heritage is supposed to like it, but I don't, guys. I mean, what do you want me to do? I can't. F I don't want to force myself to like something if I don't have to, you know. All right. So now we are left with some yellow rice, some shredded chicken, and we're gonna put this on everything. Look at this, man. I bought a, a huge bottle, and look, it's already almost halfway. All right, all right, okay, okay, hold on, hold on. I didn't even say it. Let's go, friends. Okay, okay, all right. all right. You guys probably don't even care about that. You guys probably think I'm crazy every time I say it. So let's, you know what? Let's not even say it. We're going to put this on every single thing, baby. And we're also going to put some ketchup on the rice right here. Some organic ketchup because we're healthy like that. All right. Yeah, I know. That's not healthy, the hot sauce. It's actually not bad, guys. Look 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 the reason why you know i'll have it is because the ingredients is not even that many ingredients look the ingredients is aged cajun red peppers distilled vinegar water salt and garlic powder that's the ingredients so it's not even that crazy that's why i have it all right all right my people let's eat baby let's go all right guys so there was a ride and then they never showed up so i got two dollars man at least it was in the same shopping center so i'm still here at winn dixie but two bucks, eh, that's fine. Let's uh, get some water and start. I'm gonna start driving. I didn't even finish my food. Let me start driving back and then uh, let me get some water, start driving back, and that's it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, and you made it to the end of this video. Thank you for watching. All right, this is how much we made for the day. On Lyft, we made $20.22. On Uber, we made $138.94. And on Instacart, we made $15.83 for a total of. $174.99. Guys, I um the, the reason why I titled this video this is because I said, you know what? I did not make 250, but I'm just gonna continue doing this strategy. It was the slow first I was upset, like man, I didn't make 250, but I'm like, man, it's Wednesday, the slowest day of the week, $175. I mean, that's nothing to sneeze about. That's not bad, man. So you know what I'm gonna do to preserve my mental health? I'm just going to do the same strategy that I did, $20 per hour, $1 per uh, mile, and then even if it takes me up north, I will accept it, guys. I will accept it no matter what, and then I'll start driving down, and then if I get an order, I'll get an order. If not, not. So you know what? I'm going to do this strategy, work from 12 p.m. to 12 a.m., 12 hours, and then whatever money I make, I make it. Whatever money I don't make, I don't make. I'm going to stop stressing out, trying to make 250 I think I can make the 250 though during the weekend when it's busy, like Friday night, Saturday, and Sunday. But I have to stay out from 12 to 12 for real. I think I can make 250, if not 230 or something like that. But I'm just gonna do it like that. Whatever Instacart and Uber and Lyft and all the other apps wanna feed me, as long as it satisfies the $20 per hour, $1 per mile, you know what? I'm just gonna do it. I'm not gonna stress that, like, oh, like it's slow, like, oh, I'm waiting, you know, this and that, oh my gosh, and you, you know what? Forget it, that's it. That's gonna be my schedule, 12 to 12, unless, you know, I have to do something else outside of work, or, you know, something personal or something, but that's gonna be the schedule, guys. And I'm done with the stress, that's it, that's it. But these are the orders that we did off camera. First, we did a $6.80 Instacart order that had to be canceled because it was out of stock. So I called, it was $11. Had to cancel it, ended up being $6.80. And then a $9.03 order, Instacart, $6.37 base, paid $2.66 tip. 
and then the nine dollar and 31 cent order 3.1 miles 25 minutes to complete for uber and then a fourteen dollar and seven cent order 4.3 miles 28 minutes to complete six dollar order 2.7 miles 17 minutes to complete eight dollars and 40 cent order 4.4 miles 21 minutes to complete eight dollars and two cent order 7.9 miles 17 minutes to complete that one kind of hurt because i didn't get anything on the way back but if it was a weekend maybe i would have gotten something on the way back but since it is you know slow as day not many people order i i drove all the way back dead miles guys but i did drive 140 miles for the 175 dollars that i made so and this is from leaving the house to coming back so that's not bad i guess you know we all want two dollars a mile but as long as it's like dollar fifty ish you know for the most part you know what we could work with that and that is pretty much it guys there's no more orders that we did off camera now if you made it to the end of this journey though my lovely humans thank you for watching don't forget to smash that like button to help me blow up the youtube world and if you like this video and you want to watch future videos me doing delivery sure subscribe to my people my people have a good day have a good year have a good career stay hustling out there love yourself and living yourself it's your boy Joe Weezy. let's go